Lobster. The word alone conjures images of celebration and delicious meals. Whether it's a luxurious dinner at a high-end restaurant or a festive family gathering, lobster has become synonymous with special occasions and indulgence. This delicacy, once considered peasant food, has become a global sensation. In the early days, lobsters were so plentiful that they were used as fertilizer and fed to prisoners. Over time, however, their status transformed dramatically. But have you ever stopped to think about the journey of that lobster from the ocean floor to your plate? The process is intricate and involves a blend of age-old techniques and modern advancements. It's a fascinating story that spans centuries, filled with tradition, innovation, and now a touch of artificial intelligence. From the simple wooden traps of yesteryears to today's sophisticated equipment, the evolution of lobster fishing is a testament to human ingenuity. For generations, lobster fishing has been more than just an industry. It's a way of life. Families pass down their knowledge and skills, creating a rich tapestry of culture and tradition that is deeply intertwined with the sea. Coastal communities around the world depend on these crustaceans for their livelihood. In places like Maine, Nova Scotia, and parts of Europe, lobster fishing is a cornerstone of the local economy, providing jobs and sustaining entire towns. The history of lobster fishing is a testament to human ingenuity and our evolving relationship with the sea. Early fishermen relied on their intimate knowledge of the ocean and its rhythms, using handmade traps and simple boats to harvest their catch. It's a story of adapting to challenges and embracing new technologies, a story that continues to unfold today. Modern lobster fishing incorporates GPS, sonar, and even AI to locate and catch lobsters more efficiently and sustainably. Join us as we dive into the fascinating world of lobster fishing, exploring its rich history and the exciting possibilities that lie ahead in the age of artificial intelligence. We'll look at how technology is helping to ensure the sustainability of lobster populations, protecting this valuable resource for future generations. This is a journey that reveals not only the evolution of an industry, but also our changing relationship with the ocean and its valuable resources. As we navigate the waters of the past and present, we'll uncover the stories of the people who have dedicated their lives to lobster fishing and the innovations that are shaping its future. The day begins early for lobster fishermen. Before the sun rises, they are already out at sea, preparing their traps and setting their lines. It's a demanding job that requires physical strength, skill, and a deep understanding of the ocean. Each trap is a gamble, a test of patience and knowledge. The fishermen check their traps, hoping for a bountiful catch. The lobsters are carefully measured to ensure they meet size regulations, protecting young lobsters and ensuring the sustainability of the population. The journey from the ocean to the dinner table is a long one, but it's a journey that brings joy and sustenance to many. Families gather to enjoy the fruits of the fishermen's labor, creating memories that last a lifetime. Behind the scenes, scientists are working to understand more about lobsters and their habitats. Research is crucial in developing sustainable fishing practices and ensuring that lobster populations remain healthy and abundant. Technology is playing an increasingly important role in lobster fishing. Fishermen now use tablets and apps to track their catches, monitor weather conditions, and navigate the seas more safely and efficiently. Lobster fishing is not just an industry, it's a community. Festivals and events celebrate the rich heritage of lobster fishing bringing people together to honor the traditions and innovations that make this way of life possible. The future of lobster fishing lies in the hands of the next generation. Young fishermen learn from their elders, absorbing the knowledge and skills that have been passed down through the years. They are the stewards of this tradition, carrying it forward into the future. As the day comes to an end, the lobster boats return to harbor, their holds filled with the day's catch. It's a moment of satisfaction and relief, a testament to the hard work and dedication of the fishermen. The final step in the journey is the kitchen, where the lobsters are prepared and cooked to perfection. Whether boiled, grilled, or baked, the result is a delicious meal that is enjoyed by people all over the world. From the ocean floor to the dinner table, the story of lobster fishing is one of tradition, innovation, and community. It's a story that continues to evolve, shaped by the people who dedicate their lives to this remarkable industry. As we look to the future, the challenges and opportunities of lobster fishing will continue to unfold. With a commitment to sustainability and a respect for the ocean, the legacy of lobster fishing will endure for generations to come. Thank you for being with us so far on this fascinating journey through the world of lobster fishing. 
We hope that you are gained a deeper appreciation for the hard work and dedication that goes into bringing this delicacy to our plate. Before we continue, if you are enjoying this video, feel free to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to receive future updates. Centuries ago, the lobster wasn't a prized delicacy. In fact, it was often considered a poor man's food. Early coastal communities in North America and Europe would gather lobsters directly from tide pools or shallow waters. There were no fancy boats or traps back then. Lobster fishing was a much simpler affair. People would wade into the shallows and simply pick up lobsters by hand. Sometimes they used basic tools like spears or hooks to catch them. As demand for lobster grew, so did the need for more efficient fishing methods. Over time, lobster fishing evolved significantly. From the early days of hand-catching lobsters along the rocky shores to the sophisticated methods we see today, the journey has been remarkable. One of the most important developments in this journey was the invention of the lobster trap. Before traps, fishermen relied on rudimentary methods, often diving into the cold waters to catch lobsters by hand. Early traps were simple wooden contraptions, but they revolutionized the industry. These traps, often made from local timber, were designed to lure lobsters inside with bait, making the process much more efficient. Fishermen could bait these traps and leave them on the ocean floor, returning later to collect their catch. This method not only saved time but also allowed for a more sustainable approach to lobster fishing, as it reduced the need for constant human presence in the water. This allowed them to catch lobsters in deeper waters and in larger quantities. The traps could be left for days, giving lobsters time to enter and get caught. This innovation led to a significant increase in lobster yields, supporting the livelihoods of many coastal communities. The development of sturdier boats further expanded the reach of lobster fishermen. Early boats were small and often not seaworthy enough for long journeys. However, as boat building techniques improved, fishermen could build larger, more durable vessels. No longer confined to the shoreline, they could venture further out to sea, accessing new and abundant lobster populations. These advancements in boat technology meant that fishermen could explore previously unreachable areas, discovering rich lobster grounds that were teeming with life. Modern lobster traps have also seen significant advancements. Today, they are made from durable materials like metal and plastic, designed to withstand the harsh conditions of the ocean. These traps are more efficient and environmentally friendly, often equipped with escape vents to allow undersized lobsters to return to the sea. Technology has further transformed lobster fishing. With the advent of GPS and advanced navigation systems, fishermen can now pinpoint the best fishing spots with incredible accuracy. This not only maximizes their catch, but also ensures that they are fishing sustainably, avoiding overfished areas. Once caught, lobsters are quickly transported to processing facilities where they are prepared for market. These facilities have also evolved, incorporating modern techniques to ensure the lobsters are kept fresh and of the highest quality. The journey of lobster fishing from the early days to the present is a testament to human ingenuity and adaptability. Today, lobsters are a prized delicacy enjoyed by people all over the world, thanks to the hard work and innovation of generations of fishermen. As the sun sets over the ocean, we can appreciate the milestones in lobster fishing that have brought us to this point. Each development, from the humble wooden trap to the modern fishing boat, has played a crucial role in shaping the industry we know today. Lobster fishing is often a family affair, a tradition that binds generations together through shared experiences and knowledge. Passed down through generations, this craft is more than just a means of livelihood, it is a way of life. Experienced lobstermen possess a wealth of knowledge about the sea and the behavior of lobsters, knowledge that has been honed over decades. They know the best fishing grounds, the secret spots where lobsters are most abundant, and the seasonal patterns that affect their movements. The ideal depths for setting traps are determined by a combination of intuition and experience, often varying with the time of year and the specific conditions of the water. Lobstermen are adept at recognizing the subtle signs of a healthy lobster population, such as the size and color of the lobsters and the condition of their shells. Traditional lobster fishing relies heavily on this inherited wisdom and intuition. The methods used have been refined over generations, blending time-tested techniques with modern innovations. Lobstermen carefully monitor their traps, checking them regularly to ensure they are functioning properly and to maximize their catch. 
they make adjustments based on factors like weather, tides, and the lunar cycle, all of which can influence lobster behavior and trap success. The presence of predators is another critical factor. Lobstermen must be vigilant, as predators can not only reduce the lobster population, but also damage traps. It's a demanding job that requires patience, resilience, and a willingness to face the elements. Lobstermen often work in challenging conditions, braving rough seas and inclement weather. They handle lobsters with care, respecting the marine environment and ensuring that their practices do not harm the delicate ecosystem. The lobster fishing community takes pride in these traditions, coming together for community gatherings and events that celebrate their shared heritage. Recognizing the importance of sustainable fishing practices, lobstermen are committed to conservation efforts. They understand that protecting the lobster population is essential for the future of their industry. To protect the lobster population for future generations, they teach their children the same values and techniques, ensuring that the art of lobster fishing continues to thrive. Maintenance of equipment is another crucial aspect of lobster fishing. Lobstermen spend countless hours repairing traps and maintaining their boats, ensuring everything is in top condition for the next outing. Once the lobsters are caught, they are often sold at local markets, where they are a prized commodity. The freshness and quality of the lobsters are a testament to the skill and dedication of the lobstermen. The bond among lobstermen is strong, forged through shared experiences and mutual respect. They often share stories and tips, fostering a sense of camaraderie and community. Many lobstermen also advocate for marine conservation, participating in programs that aim to protect the ocean and its inhabitants. Their first-hand knowledge of the sea makes them valuable allies in these efforts. The joy of a successful catch is a reward in itself, a culmination of hard work, skill, and a deep connection to the sea. For lobstermen, each day on the water is a testament to their enduring legacy and their unwavering commitment to their craft. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to receive future updates.